It's been dry and windy across southern Arizona. That's what helped one fire spread across the Dragoon Mountains in Cochise County. Now, on your side's Greg Bradbury shows us the conditions firefighters were dealing with. The fire was on the mountains behind me, but the good news is the smoke and the flames have gone away for the most part after firefighters were able to stop forward progress. Throughout the day, firefighters worked to push back the flames of the Middle March fire that started on Sunday and quickly spread throughout the mountain. It was about 30 minutes before we were actually able to get out there, so that was time that it had to spread all the way out to all the way up into the mountains right there and then before the Forest Service was able to get in there and start initial attack on it. Campgrounds near the area were evacuated as the flames continued to spread. The fire reached 455 acres of land burned before they were able to halt forward progress. They had some aerial support, but the bulk of the flames were halted by about 80 to 90 people on the ground. This morning it actually wasn't, it was pretty much the same way it is now. Flames have been knocked down, uh, not much smoke visible, things like that. But last night the whole mountain was glowing, there were still active flames. So it was a major progress to this morning from around 11 last night. Winds were gusting throughout the day, which made stopping the fire more difficult. Stewart says when the conditions are like this, they need your help to prevent these fires. Just if you see anything that could potentially spark something up, if you have any open flames, just please try not to create sparks or have open flames, anything like that, because with this wind and how dry it is, anything could start up a fire right now. Now there's no word yet on what caused the fire, but like he said, with these conditions, it doesn't take much to start one. Reporting in Tombstone, Greg Bradbury, KGUN 9, on your side.